Hello everyone, Mickey Sticky Flowers, Sticky Icky Cheese over Icky there. Icky Cheese here. We're back in Indiana State Road Place, so basically we're here. Um, I, I gotta tell you something that I found, man. I went inside this building and I found something. I found a TV, man. And I'm look. And I'm. You got the door for it, man. I took it. I took I took the TV, man, and it. it Oh, it's a TV. Yeah, it's a TV, man. And there's a nice truck here. I might load the TV in the back. Maybe see if the keys are in there. Yeah, hold on, man. Let me check and see if the keys are in it. The back opened up, man. Keys. Uh, let me check the uh, underneath the visor. Oh yeah, keys falling right in my lap. Ah, oh, nice man. Several hours later. I mean, I don't know what we're gonna do with this TV. Might might as well have to sell it because I mean, we live in the van, man. I don't got no place to put. I don't think it would even fit in there. That thing is pretty big, man. The guys there yelling at me he said, What are you doing? He said, I'm unhooking the TV. He said, Why? I said, I'm taking it. He said, You can't take it. I'm going to call the cops. And I, I took it out the wall, off the like, little brackets, and then like I just took all the wires, unplugged them, and uh, I just walked out. Oh, wow, man. So you just did the display model? Yeah, I, I took the display model, man. Showing menus whenever we go to plug it in. And now that that that's like uh, if we still like a McDonald's TV or something. Oh, okay. It had like it had like the football channel on. Uh oh. We're literally four. I'm myself, by the way. Okay. Wow, they're blocking us in, man. What's going on, man? I don't know, man. There's one behind Is us. Registered? I don't know. It's, I mean, it's technically not mine. I don't know if it's mine. I mean, you can say it's yours. They probably won't know. To say that you just bought it. Although, I don't know if that guy called for the TV and they see a TV in the back. Yeah, I'm having multiple conversations in my head. That's my muted man. Good afternoon, sir. How's it going? Hey, man. District Captain Sylvester with the Indiana State Police. You know the reason for the stop? No, I don't, District Captain, sir. <laughs> All right. So the reason for the stop is you blew that stop sign at CVU and Joshua. Oh, oh dang. Oh, yeah, literally blew it. Like, didn't even slow down, blew it. Damn, Dickie. You got a license Shit. registration on you? Uh, yeah, hold on. He's kind of scared of these cops around here, man. Hey, Sawyer. Howdy. Any ideas of why Adams and his radio is not working? No, because I don't know anything about the radio. Why are there so many cops, man? I don't know. You're kind of scared, man. 
No reason to be scared, man. Why they need these many caps? What do we do? I think you just got lucky. Two cars that were uh, running Union happened to be right here. Yeah, but he said. Nah, I don't think that was luck, man. I don't want to run in the caps. Well, I don't run stop signs. I don't know what to tell you. I'll tell my buddy. I'm not driving. <laughs> All right. Listen, uh, while the other officers are uh, having their conference here, uh, can I go ahead and get your license, registration, and proof of insurance, please? Here, handed my ID. He already handed it to you, man. <laughs> oh, I didn't. I didn't get it. What? What's your last name? My last name is Cheese, man. All right, man. You still didn't hand me your license. You got a license on you? There's three unions here. I thought I did. Now that other officer's got it. T slash show ID, space bar, and the number above my head. Yeah, I know. I just gave the other officer my ID. Somebody's got my ID. Right, so we have an ID. We have an issue, man. I uh, believe this plate's coming up stolen, dog. Stolen? I thought, I thought you bought the truck, Dicky. Yeah, well, I'm gonna take a look at it. So, so type for me, all right? Uh, uh, I could have swore you said you bought the truck earlier. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, I put my TV back there. Hopefully, if, I mean, if it's stolen, uh, hopefully they give, hopefully they give him a TV, man. It was a hard time getting that thing. Yeah, it was a heavy TV. I know, it was right off the wall, man. <laughs> just, I just lifted up the brackets and plugged everything and walked out. Okay, so you, uh, you're you coming from a buddy's house then, or was that your house you're coming from? It just came from the Walmart, man. The Walmart, okay, and you removed a TV from the wall at the Walmart? No, I, I didn't. I removed the TV from home, maybe. Okay. Uh, what's ho where's home for you? Uh, my van. And now I'm in this car, so this is my home now. Okay, your van. Oh, where do you usually park your van? Is it usually in the same spot, or do you move it around a lot? So this place oh, I move, pop I, it up I, in my I move it around a lot, man, because I get in okay. trouble because cops come and say you can't park here. Gotcha, gotcha. Have you tried going to a KOA or maybe a RV park? Uh, yeah, I don't got money for that. Oh, I understand, I understand. Uh, you might try some uh, campgrounds. Those places sometimes let you stay there a couple days without having to pay. Well, what I'll do uh, I, I, maybe I, like Coachella to our left. Yeah, we should, we should try it, man. Gotcha. So where's the van now? Uh, well, I'm not telling you. Okay. Well, where are you headed right now, then, if you just came from Walmart? I don't know. It's wherever Dickie went to go next. I just wanted to go to Walmart. in my van. Okay. Okay. So you both have your own separate vans? Yep. Then? Yep. But not yeah. the same van? You don't You don't stay together? No. No. I not, stay in my van? Not anymore. I stay in my van. He stays in his van. Okay. And then, so who owns this truck? Dickie bought it. Well, I'm okay. borrowing it from a buddy. You're borrowing it from a buddy? What's the buddy's name? Huh? Jim. Bob. Jim? Wingledorf. You seem a little bit shaky on the uh, the name there for Jim Bob Wingledorf. Yeah, that's his name. It's his name, huh? Okay. You got a phone number for Jim Bob Wingledorf? Uh, I don't even have a phone, man. Yeah, we're, we're too poor to own that. But you own two separate you you own two separate vans though. Oh yeah, we bought them back in the seventies, man. Okay. Uh, how do you get a hold of Jim Bob Wingledorf when you want to borrow his truck? Then how'd you how'd you get in touch with that guy? We just gotta drive around for hours and hours and try to find him. Sometimes we never do. Yeah, we we normally just go to his house. Or he sometimes is at the Walmart. That's why we tried going there. Yeah. Usually camps out behind the Walmart. <laughs> All right, Mr. Cheese, go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me. Uh, why? What's going on, man? This vehicle is returning stolen. Just go stolen. ahead and step out. Passenger, go ahead and step out as well, please. Yeah, both of you just go ahead and step out. Oh, man. I don't want to step out. 
Well, I get, uh, I guess. I'm not gonna ask nicely. Uh, do me a favor again. I know. I said I don't okay. want to, but I did. Okay. Let me shut my door. Yep. I appreciate Got that. Go ahead and put your hands up on the door there. I'm just gonna pat you down. Anything in your pocket's gonna poke me, stick me, touch me, uh, otherwise uh, cause discomfort? Nah, man. And I, I didn't initially introduce myself. This is uh, 15, 1528 ISP uh, held here. Yeah, just my ID, man. Okay. All right, sir. Now, I'm not placing you under arrest this time. I'm just going to go ahead and detain you at this moment. So I'm just going to place you in some cuffs. I'm not going to tighten them too tight here. I appreciate that. Just for that. while you're detained for our, your safety and mine here. Yeah, no problem. Okay, Mr. Flowers. Go ahead and walk back here with me. Go ahead and take a seat here on the ground if you wouldn't mind here, Mr. Fogg, where we get this all figured out. Yeah, one second. Okay. Anything in the truck that we need to know about? Any drugs, illicit items, illegal substances? No, the only thing that's in the truck is the TV, man. Just the TV? Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, hang tight here. You guys want to go ahead and search the truck? We got probable cause since it's stolen. If they say anything in OOC, say the TV stolen. That I'll run his right, contact. Yep, I did. Okay, Mr. Flowers. Well, the good news is I don't see any warrants coming up for you, so that's good. Now, oh, good. That stuff in Wisconsin's not popping up. Oh, well, I mean, I mean, I mean, uh, I mean, nothing. I mean, continue. Yeah. As far as I'm aware, state of Indiana has no warrants for your arrest this time. That's good. So that's that's good for you. Now, who whose TV is this here? You want to tell me that? Well, it was Walmart's TV. Walmart TV, okay. I do want to caution you at this time. Uh, anything you say and do can and will be used against you in a court of law. You do have the right to attorney. You have the right to have that attorney present. And you have the right to uh, an attorney provided to you by the state of Indiana at no cost to you if you cannot afford an attorney. And you have that right. And if I already said you have the right to have that attorney present, any, any additional and all questioning. Do you want to go ahead and continue talking to me at this time, or do you want to enact your rights? Yeah, I mean, I'll talk to you. I mean, I, I mean... Okay. Like I said, I, you're not under arrest. I did just want to go ahead and caution you with your Miranda just to be just be on the safe side for your rights, sir. Um, okay, so... Who removed the the TV? Was that, that you, Mr. Flowers, or is that Mr. Cheese who removed the well, TV from Walmart? Well, see, that was me because I had went in and I was trying to buy this TV. I only had $300, and that's how the TV was like 280 something they didn't have any more, so I told them, here's the 300 you keep the change. I ripped out the wall and walked out. Okay. All right, well, Mr. Flowers, at this time, I'm going to go ahead and just be placing you under arrest for theft. You have the right to remain silent again. Anything you say can and will be used against you in court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided to you. By the state, free of charge, you have the right to have that attorney present during any and all questioning. Uh, with these rights in mind, uh, do you want to continue talking to me? Do you understand your rights today? You already read me my rights. I already told you I would continue talking to you. Okay. That's fine. I just wanted to Mirandize you now because I am placing you under arrest for theft. I mean, I, I gave them the $300. I didn't steal it. They got the money. How is that stealing? If I gave someone money to get something, that's not stealing. Uh, so you stated that it cost more than the amount of funds you had available, and you removed it off the wall. I told you it cost two eighty. I had three hundred. I gave him the three hundred. Told him to keep the change. It's not my problem. They didn't have any more stock, so I wanted it, and I took it, and I gave him the money. 
Okay. Well, right now, let me go ahead and get right back to you here. Trooper, he's, um... Just Captain, he's uh, stating that he removed the TV from the wall at Walmart. It sounds like it was a display unit not for sale that he removed from the wall, then gave them $300 in cash, and then just left without actually checking out or confirming a sale with, with uh, Walmart. Oh, huh. how kind of him. Uh, I did read him his rights twice, uh, just to be safe. Uh, he, I did go ahead and preemptively charge him with theft. If they didn't, if they didn't have that as a display unit, and they didn't register a sale, I believe I have to check my legal, but I believe that's technically theft. Well, we also got. Uh, I mean, we can always call Walmart and ask got, if they want to press charges. We got weed in the car as well, so they're both going. Okay. Weed. Yeah. And of course, he's he's going for the driver's going for possession of stolen vehicles. So. Right. Yes, sir. I didn't stutter. Uh, are you guys able to transport him? Oh, uh, we can. Where you want him taken? Uh, we're just gonna take him up here to Sandy and uh, just. It's, that's uh, fucked up. No, there's no weed in the car. That's fucked up. Oh, where you going? Where you going? He, they said there's weed no. in the car. No, don't do it. Uh. Oh. <laughs> guys, Stay down, and the next time you're getting tased. You guys are tripping up your charges, man. It's fucked up. Sanders weed the car. Uh, just OOC his uh, name. That way I can input his charges. Did you hear me help? There you go, man. Yeah, there it is. Thank you. All right, I'm going to go ahead and start taking the other one. He was faster than I was. All right. You going to try to walk off on us again? No, you're gonna tackle me again. Well, you, right. you guys I don't know are how you me got out of the cuffs, but I don't know. But yeah, you guys are trying me up with charges. That's not my weed. I mean, this place looks really familiar. It's not a good thing for you, man. No, it's really not. If you'll back up to the cell door and I'll cuff you. Yeah, I'm used to this already. Been here a few times. Alright, I'm gonna lock it here. Alright, I'll be right back with you. It's locked. You can't get out, alright? Good job, Veers. Um, just hang out here. I'm gonna find the uh, district captain and see what we're gonna do here. Uh, I think he's on another call, but... Uh, no, I just spoke to the trainee that was with him. I think he's actually in the parking lot here. Oh, okay. okay. I guess um, I'm sit here and, uh, keep should going. take a couple seconds. If not, worst case, let's just... Depending on what I hear from him, if, if, if... Depending on what we're doing here, we'll just write him up ourselves and just, uh, get him out of here. out here. Alrighty. He's doing the paper. Why are you sitting on the ground, Trooper? Uh, I don't know why I decided to sit on the ground. That's a good question. Alright, Mr. Flowers. Yeah. Um, uh, District Captain Sylvester with the Indiana State Police. Uh, I'm going to be your arresting officer. 
I'm gonna tell you your charges as follows. You already been read to write, so um, yeah, I've been, been, I've been read my right twice. Good. Uh, at least we know you're covered. Uh, so your charges are gonna be as followed: receiving a stolen property, and also your charges is going to be uh, possession of a class uh, one drug, uh, possession of marijuana. Ah, oh, come uh, on. Your jail time is going to be a hundred, and uh, look for the biggest man, punch him in the mouth. That's how you make friends. Good luck to you. Alrighty. This is bullshit. Fucking bullshit. I'm in jail, man. Oh, there's a punchy bag. What's up, man? Uh, shit, man. Uh, I think we're getting released, man. Yeah, I think we're gonna be getting released here in a few, but damn, man. I didn't know there was weed the car. Yeah, I didn't either. Yeah, he was like, "Yeah, you're 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 go you're getting arrested for the stealing that TV." Even though I tried like telling him, I threw because like literally I went into Walmart, man, and when I went to go buy the TVs, the one I wanted, they they didn't have, so I only had three hundred dollars of the rest of the money I got from Marcus, and I literally threw the money down on the table. They didn't have no more to buy, so I just ripped the one off the wall. They said I couldn't do that. That's stealing. I said that's not stealing. I said I, I left the money there. I was like, how can I leave the money for someone? And it takes something, and it's stealing. I gave him money. I don't know, man. It's just fucked up. Something always happens every time we get to the fucking town. Yeah, then he tried telling me something about there's weed in the car, and I'm getting arrested for that. I'm like, what are you talking about? I didn't know there's weed in the car. He's like, yep. He said there's weed in the car and everything, man. It's fucked up. Come on, man. Three. Four. I was told by the officer that uh, put me in the jail cells here and whatnot, took me to prison. He told me to hit the biggest guy here. That's how I'm going to make friends. Yep. Eight. Nine. But I did that as soon as I walked in. Some Ten. guy told me I couldn't do my sit-ups there, and then I hit him and knocked him out. Miggy, Dicky, come out. You are getting released. Oh, you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. He just walked through the door. He said, We get released. Yeah. Hey, just get out of here, man. There's some fat, like. There's some fat person. Hey, let me come with you. I just broke out. No. Let me get in your trunk. Get out of here. Drive, drive. Let me get in your trunk. Go. Alright. We're kidnapping you now. Thank you. I'm a fat Two, woman, five, I'll do anything. Nine, one, one, <laughs> this car's stolen, by the way. And it's legit registered as stolen in cat. Okay, I called 9 1 and said that we kidnapped. So are they still in the car? Nope. Oh, okay. Well, I put a 911 call that we kidnapped someone at one point. Yep, flipped. I think a guy, I think a car just flipped on us, man. Are we getting pulled over again, man? 
Be serious. We just got out, man. Didn't Pedro said that this car, he got it for us? Hey, good evening. Oh, fuck. Hey, hey, hey man. Uh, name is Officer Hunt, Ross Township PD. Reason for the stop today is we got an AMA one call for a uh, kidnapping that happened, and uh, the description that was given was a uh, white two-door vehicle. I believe this is a cream color, but I don't know about no kidnapping. Yeah, hey, there's nobody in this car, just us two. It's just us. Gotcha. Um, there was some fat lady stalking us. Yeah, some fat lady. She said she threw baseballs at the cops. Oh, yeah. Favorite yeah, lady. She, yeah, she tried getting in the trunk and saying no, uh, uh, no, we could kidnap her, but no, that didn't happen. Gotcha. Maybe she tried getting us trumped up with a charge. She did. We gotcha. wanted nothing to do with her. We just got out of prison. All right. Well, uh, if that's the case, then you guys are uh, all good to go. All right. Yeah, sure. Actually, am I popping in your trunk for me real quick, just so I can be sure? Oh, sure. Yeah. yeah, thanks. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's, funny thing is, it would Wonderful. be... Wonderful. All right, you guys are good to go, then. <laughs> All right. Thanks, man. Funny thing would be, it's an admin. They they just made their number tag disappear. They were still in the trunk. Huh? <laughs> Opens it, they're still there. Like, wait a minute. Hey, oh, uh, kidnapping? What? I mean, that was weird, man. Very weird. Yeah, it's crazy how the car didn't come up stolen. It's not stolen. We got it for Pedro, man. Pedro told me, but yeah, sure, we'll go with that. Yeah, I mean, we're not gonna let them know that Pedro told us it was stolen. We're just gonna say it. We got it from our friend Pedro, man. Let's go hang out at our favorite bar. Oh, I'm not allowed to back there anymore, but yeah, let, let's go back Neither in. Neither am I, but fuck it, right? Yeah, fuck it. What's the bartender's name again? Started with a C. It was Charlotte, but she's dead. Sandra, when, when, when did you start working here? You got two jobs now? Oh, you got another baby on the way? What is this? Like? Here. Inside this bus. I'm running across the highway. Fuck that. <laughs> this is too early. <sighs> okay. Fuck. Playing a frogger. Oh shit! They're following me, bro. Don't don't run my way. Don't run my way. Don't run my way. <laughs> they found me, bro. I should have stayed in that bus. Is that a helicopter? Oh, it is. I hear a helicopter, bro. Oh. Are they looking for you? Uh, if I fell up. Uh. Uh. I want to 
get up so bad. But he, he's going lower by you. I know. I, I, I fell. As soon as I see he's going. I'm getting up. Can you turn when you're moving? Or crawling, I mean? Or are you just going one spot? Yeah, if they're about to land over me. Okay. Right? Or maybe they don't see me. What? What is what what are they doing? I, I can't see. I think they're trying to land. No. They literally left, bro. Maybe they don't want me. But no, there was cops after me, bro, for real. I crossed the highway, there was cops chasing me. Literally, I, I think it was a white charger, if I'm not mistaken. This cop? No, there, there's no cops on me. I'm crawling. I've been crawling for a good minute since I jumped off and fell. Because I'm RPing that I'm hurt. I didn't think that was a long drop, to be honest with you. hear him still. I don't know where he's at. He's like, uh, he's at that one drug place in the, uh, online where you make your weed profits at. The one that you owned by the train track over there. Oh, he's coming back over this way. What did you do? Oh, he's over me. Does he see me? He's gotta see me. No flipping way that he doesn't see me. Maybe they think we're still up there. Don't know, dude. I'm gonna continue crawling if I could, if I make it somewhere. I hear him. He's super loud. Yeah, he's right above me. I'm I'm crawling over the road right now. Do you think he sees you? He hasn't seen me since, but he's over me right now. This is like his fourth time over me. No, he's flying. Wait, wait, he's turning around again. Maybe he's trying to spot us flashlight on me? I don't know. I don't know. He's going back towards your way. Wait, wait, he's going back this way again. He's right above me. His rotors are, his rotors are about to break. I want to dip so bad. Yeah, if he's got the spotlight on me. He's got the spotlight on you. I'm dipping. <laughs> Yeah, he's right above me. I'm just crawling. I've been in the crawly mode. Yep. He's got the spotlight on me now. Fully, physically. Yeah. I think I'm in the clear. I'm not gonna do anything stupid. Like, I'm just, like, running. You should go back to the bar. I'm in the farmlands. You should run back to the bar and they do a 911 call that the bar people call the police on you. But like, you guys are chasing me? Nah, you guys weren't chasing me. I've been here at the bar the whole time. No cops showed up. I think there's cops still at the bar. <laughs> I don't know if there is. I know this helicopter's still following me. 
I'm just in the crawly mode. I can see flashing lights from him. From who? The cop? From the helicopter. Yeah, he's got flashing lights. Is he trying to land? I think he's trying to land. Oh, I'm going to get out the way. I don't want him to see me. Yep. He landed. He's got the spotlight on me. Maybe I'll try and do some shots towards your way. Yeah, just shot off the gun. Uh, ow. Just stay still for me, all right? What happened? I broke my I broke my leg. All right, how'd you do that? Well, I climbed, I, I was climbing up something, and I didn't know it was a far jump, and I thought I could make it, and I jumped off, and it broke my leg. What'd you jump off of? Uh, like, one of these, like, uh, somewhere over here, like, one of these tall things. I, it wasn't, like, really high, but, I mean, I jumped off, and I broke my leg, man. Alright, is there any, any pain everywhere else except for your leg? Nah, just my leg. Everything else feels fine. Alright. Just go ahead and answer the skybox for me. Alright. What does the skybox say? I don't see a skybox right now. Oh, yeah. So, and probably me. just only 22. Right. Yeah. Shot on the helicopter, but I don't know if the priority is us. Just do it. I think it is us. It's not like you're shooting a gun at him, you're just throwing a flare. Ah! No, I was thinking about doing that. Alright, I'm gonna load you up into the ambulance for you, alright? Because I can't, I can't shoot the flare. Alright. Got one, two, three. Okay, I'm going to. Uh, I, I'm not in trouble. I'm just getting taken to the hospital. No cop wanted me or nothing. They're looking for you, bro. I think so. I don't know. <laughs> Passing the bar. No one's there. The car's still there. The stolen car's there. Where'd the helicopter go? Helicopter left. It only found me. You're in the clear, bro. And as I and, and as they say, they didn't ask like the medic didn't ask me anything. He just asked me what happened. I said I was climbing the things over there, and I gave him the postal code. I basically just said I, I was jump. I jumped off. I didn't think it was far, and I thought I was gonna make it, but I broke my leg. And then after that, he loaded me up, and he's taking me to the hospital. Other than that, I'm fine. I'm not going to jail. Now, now you're free. I would say go. I'd say, I would say go back to the bar, and then when I get, when I get out of the hospital, I'll meet you at the bar, and, and we could do a 911 call saying that we're at the bar. Ooh. 
Is there a cop? Several hours later. I'm in a stolen van. I'm going to try to make it to the bar. I put out a 911 call for that Mustang that we stole. Okay. And it's through my biker character. That's who it's registered to. Okay. And that, so that Mustang is at the bar, but I put the postal code like right down the road from the bar right before you get there okay i said my mustang has been stolen help uh please help and it's uh it's a cream colored mustang the plate registers boostang with zeros oh shit didn't realize you go in there huh what the factory place we were just at yeah yeah apparently you and they updated it and you and there's garage doors on the outside you can go in there oh, that's cool I'm about to be heading up to Joshua. I'm crossing the highway now. I just gotta be hoping. careful because I'm in a stolen van. Yeah, I'm hoping I don't see any cops. I'm hoping I don't see a cop either because that plate reader goes off. Yeah. They're gonna pull me over and wait. Beep beep. Yeah, <laughs> where'd you get that van from? Okay, I'm coming up to the stop sign. About to make a left. Oh. What? There's what? Cop, there's cop, there's cops. I'm 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 pulling. Oh shit, yeah, I see him down there. Well, I parked a van, like, you know, when you come up to that stop center, Joshua, like those garages right there. I, par mm -hmm. I parked a van right there and got out. Oh, they saw me jump that fence. I'm pretty sure they did. Oh, this is suspicious. How am I going to get there? Because there's cops here, bro. Just going to want... Say anything, but what are you talking about? I just got released from the hospital. Man, I can't believe that when the ambulance came, and they, they didn't like even the helicopter didn't question anything. I should be in jail right now. I wonder if my, I wonder if Dickie went to jail. I mean, he told me that he'd try to meet me back here. I'm gonna walk inside, see if it's here. If not, I'm just gonna get a beer. I don't give a fuck if I'm banned. But, can't ban me. I'm a paying for a customer. Ugh. Yeah, what up, man? What's going on, man? And that much. I just got back from the hospital, broke my leg. Broke your leg. Yeah, the helicopter was following me, man. I yeah, got scared. Yeah, that motherfucker was crazy, man. And then, you. and then I jumped off this thing, and I thought I would make it, and I was falling, and then I look, as I was falling, I was looking down, I'm like, yeah, dude, this seems farther, and I kept falling, and all of a sudden, I just heard it like a crunch. Uh, damn, man. It, it puts you in, like, a shim or anything? Yeah, I'm in a little shim. I mean, it's not fully broken, it's fractured. But I heard like a little Damn. cracking. Damn, that sucks. Well, I got a call for Pedro. Turns out that Mustang out there is definitely registered stolen. Oh, it is, man? Yep. I didn't think it was. Damn. 
Hey, what, what is that, Sandra? There's signs on there saying we can't be here. Fuck you. We're paying customers. We come there a lot to the Yellow Jack. Why are you going to be dicks to us, man? Yeah, I know. Our faces are on the wall, though. Yeah. I'm oh, surprised well. you ain't called the cops yet. Yeah, I'm surprised. Don't be calling the cops over there, Sandra. I don't know, but I saw the guy that was wearing a suit behind uh, her walk to the back door over there. But yeah. Hopefully he doesn't call the cops. <laughs> Might have to go take care of him. I guess I gotta go take care of him. Hey, I'll come with the help, man. Hey, don't worry, Sandra. We gotta take care of someone real quick. Hey, motherfucker, where you going? Where you going? Hey, get back here. Let's bury him. I'll start digging. Just gotta dig enough to cover the body. We can't. We don't got time for a six feet grave, man. Nope. Sure. By now, somebody would probably call them shots and probably Sandra. Probably. There we go. Dang you piece of shit. <laughs> Alright, let's cover him back up. Alright, we're covering him up. Alright, that should be good enough. Fuck that piece of shit. Let's go get some beer and celebrate. Hey, Xandra, two bears on the house on me. We're celebrating. Go. Cheers. Cheers, man. That's like the second person that was, uh, yeah, you know, back there. Yep. Right next to, uh, what's your name? Oh, yeah, Charlotte. Yeah, Charlotte. Yeah, I know, I know it begins with a C. I mean, but she didn't last too long. Nope. Hey, Sandra, you didn't call the cops, did you? Maybe. You should, that's not good. You should never caught them. Well, you said maybe, so I think you did. Either you did or you didn't. Either you tell the truth, Sandra. Did you call? I ain't gonna be upset. We didn't do anything. We're just here celebrating. I think she did call Scott. Yeah, I think she did too. What'd you say? Something about that car can't be parked there? That's not our car. No, we did get out in it. You didn't see that. The CCTV? Fuck the CCTV. Bullshit. Hey, she's saying that she's got a video of us walking out of that car, man. Screw you, Sanjo. You're gonna be next back there. Hey, give me a whiskey. She just told you no, man. She says she ain't serving us no more. 
fine. I'll take the cut myself. <laughs> yeah, I'll take another beer myself. Fuck you, Sandra. Uh oh. Excuse me. What's going on, man? Uh, which one of y'all are calling? Say again? Uh, which one of y'all called us? I think it was the bar owner lady. She got scared. Yeah, the local bartender. Well, can we have y'all hop outside for us? Oh, man. That bitch is always calling on us. Yeah, man. Well, gentlemen, look. Both of y'all are very unwanted at this bar. Y'all were both banned a month ago. Okay? So look. Yeah. Best it's my man, it's our favorite bar. We're paying the money. You know, there's another, there's honestly a better bar in Painter of a Drive. Past the What's airport. You know the one I'm talking about, Yellow Jack? The Yellow Jack? No, that bar is crappy, man. I'm telling you, they got better beer. It's run down. No, it's I mean, expensive. Maybe, but I mean, maybe it's a little more right. pricey. I'd but... buy some beer for fifty cents. Yeah, the yeah, cheap right. shit. Yeah. All right, cheap shit. Wait, you bought beer on the clock? No, it was off shift. But now you're on shift, a little drunk, right? So you've already had a beer I this got morning. It last night. But you just said you that. You just said today. That was last night for me. Twelve a.m. This this guy's not making any sense, man. Yeah, I don't think he's making I any sense. I just started man. working right now. I'm pretty sober, so I think we should give him a breathalyzer, man. Yeah, you're kind of mumbling, man. You're stumbling so, your words. So the both of y'all, y'all best on getting y'all car and leave. Okay, leave the property. We don't. This ain't, no this ain't our car. This ain't your car. How'd y'all get here? We walked. We walked. I just got back from the hospital. Get to walking them. No. We walked. Y'all, somebody's gonna walk. I think that car's stolen. Boop. Y'all gotta walk. Did you just boop his nose? Yep. I don't think he likes that. Come, come on, let's let's walk. Walk where? Boop. The walk to off the property. Did you just boop his nose again? Yep. So I could. He said he's giving us a ride. No, I didn't say that guy out the car. Oh, okay. I guess he's giving us a ride. Alright, get on this side, man. No. Get out of the car. Get 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 on the side, get in the back. We're, we're getting a ride, man. No, you're not. Get out the car. Alright, Jesus, you're no fun. This guy's giving us a ride. No, I'm not. You can get out, otherwise you're going to get tased. Ah, oh, jeez, this guy's rude too. Walk Whoa. off the property. I guess we could just take his car. Yeah. That guy will give you a ride, he said. This guy will give me. Yeah. No, don't get in my car. Okay, you're under arrest. Fine, I'll get out. <laughs> Those guys are assholes, man. Fuck those guys. Yeah, they're fucking pigs. That one right there, and that one right there. Listen. He said we gotta get up the property. We're off the property, man. We should just start walking around the property. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, let's start walking this way. See if he comes. Yep. Let's walk like behind it, like we're walking towards the highway in Kitty Corner. So it looks like we're walking towards it. We'll walk right in the back right here. We'll Kitty Corner it. 
I was gonna go a little bit further. Nah, I want to be close. We weren't walking. We weren't going in the property. I want to, cause I want us to walk right past it. We're not going in it. We're just walking past it. I'm walking. Go like we're going to this house right here. Up, 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 up. Here, here comes the other cop. Yep, he's watching. He's watching us. He's watching hardcore. I know he is. Because he knows that we're trying to go back. That's what I'm really trying to do. I want to get back in there. Where's he at? I can't see him. Oh! I'm going to literally try to get back in there. I'm walking through the back. Watch them be in the back door. I'm gonna creep in there. Hold on, I'm gonna crouch. E slash crouch. Is there a cop out there? I don't see one. Hold on. I'm gonna go towards the window and see if I see one. Alright. Yep, he's still out there. Or, yep. Still's registers. Or we can Let's go. Let's we'll, go, man. We'll run we'll run out the uh Across the highway again. Ooh, is that cop coming? I don't know. I keep looking back to see. Slash you say there's a two zero four nine. I'm gonna go hide in this garage. Bar owner calls in again. Two hippies were thing came in and stole both cash registers. CCTV. I'm inside this garage. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, there's the money. There's the money. to oh 250 I got 250 out of that register man hell yeah man how much was in that register 400 oh, nice we gotta go we got we gotta find a car and we need to go we, we need to go get our van But I don't want them to find the van because if they do, they're going to find all that money from Mona's death in there and they might they think that's stolen too. When it was running from the cops earlier when the helicopter was about, yeah. I, swore I, saw, I swore I saw a truck over here. Could have been. We could, we could look. We just got to make it somewhere. Yeah, I, th I think I see it. Alright, cool. Yeah, we just got to make it somewhere and call it a night or whatnot, maybe. Yeah. 
We can try and make it to Coachella. Yeah. Just hang out there. Yeah, I think that's where uh, I think that's where your van's at. Yeah. Okay, I'll crash in your van tonight. All right, man. Hey, we just gotta lay low for a while. Mm -hmm. But I can't believe, like, literally, like, the helicopter flew over me earlier, bro, and then I thought, like, the cops were gonna come, but literally, just the ambulance came, and they asked what was wrong, I said, my leg, and they let me, took me to the hospital, and let me go. I, I said, I'm not going to jail, They're like, for what? You didn't do anything. Yeah, I know, man, that, that kind of sucks. How far was that fall? Uh, from, from my eyes, it looked like maybe, like, four or five feet, but in reality, it was probably, like, over ten. Damn. Yeah, as soon as I jumped, I thought I was going to make it. And then as I jumped, I kept falling and falling and falling. And I realized I messed up. Oh, wait, you smashed the window, man. It was unlocked. think it was it wouldn't I, I, that's I was unlocked yeah I could have locked it for you I didn't think about it yeah of course I have it yep all right let's hope we make it to Coachella man yeah I'm gonna hand you to uh, I'm gonna hand you to 250 because you could put all that money together you got a safe box in your van I don't yeah. I forgot where I parked my van at. It's been a while. I think maybe that new connect. I think he brought it down to uh I think he brought it down to Los Angeles the other day when we happened to just randomly go to Los Angeles for a while. There's a cop up there. I just know it's gonna fucking go off. Oh yeah, it's gonna go off. I mean, if we have to, we'll just go park it and then get out. Go go up to the parking lot when you get the uh the where you make a right to go to uh, to fucking grape seed that little parking lot right there. He's 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 like right there in the bushes, like right in front of us. So where you see that sign that says gas. We could park the car here and get out all and walk, but then again, we're already bolted, so yeah. Either way, we're gonna get caught. If we walk, we get caught, or we drive this, we're gonna get caught. Mm -hmm. Unless you turn around and try to go like this. Dirt, is there a dirt road over here we could take on the left? Uh, I don't think so. I would have to go like all the way around and then come up back through uh, Main Street over here. And then come up that way, and then make that turn right there. Or maybe turn or turn around, take the highway, and then get off the highway. We won't pass that cop if we go this way. Nope, he's still sitting there. I don't want to just go past him. Hey, yeah, I mean, if you want. We have to lose, right? This is a nice rental, man. How much did it cost for this rental car, man? Just trying to, like, you know. I said it's a rental AI car. AI the, AI the fuck out of it. Yeah, but I was hitting the inky talking, so. Oh man, I don't know. It wasn't. It wasn't cheap. Yeah, I bet it wasn't. I think we're gonna make it. All right. If we make it to Coachella, we could continue this another time. Ah, uh, another day. We made it, man. Here, have a cigarette. I found my bong in the van. Oh, nice, man. Cool. Well, we made it another day, man. <laughs> yep, 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 we did. 
Well, we'll just go to bed, and then next time we wake up and go travel out, we'll just hope we don't get cut. But until we get it. Until next time. Yep, but until next time, Mickey and... Dicky. Yeah, the Mickey and Sticky Brothers. Mickey, Dicky, Sticky Brothers for life. Thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. We didn't get caught. We basically, I don't know how I got away. Um, and you all are going to be surprised when you watch this episode. And you've probably already seen that because you're here at the end. So uh, uh, tell, me, uh, tell me what you think about that. How did I get away? Two hippies. We made the 911. Helicopter is flying over me. Didn't see me. Well, it did see me after a while. And then it had the spotlight on me. Ambulance came. They assessed me. Took me to the hospital. I was like, go free. How does that happen? I don't know. And Dickie didn't even caught weird. And we went back and stole. So, yep. I'm not sure if they're going to remember us from having that the next time. But if not, we'll make sure we do a 911 call. And we're going to continue on with what we happened at the bar today and whatnot. And then, yeah. And we'll get into more trouble. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. Mickey and Dickie out.